Look at him. There's a power he's putting. Oh, yeah. So look at him on the fader. Come here. Cigarette. Right there. Get all around this thing. He's got a part of it. On the wall. Yeah. Look, look, look. Oh, yeah. Look, look. Oh, yeah. Look, look. Oh, yeah. Look, look. Oh, Bring them back over here where you can film. I mean, this thing will be full of them. I've never seen them like it. But I estimate we're waiting your turn. Yeah, I've seen, you, yeah, you I've seen, seen them above there. Yeah, I've seen them out here like that. Plus all these over here. Yeah, they drank a gallon they were Really? Yeah. I just made a new gallon day sitting in there. Did you hear that hickory? Yeah. A gallon? Yeah. Drink a gallon a day. I peeled those uh, 16 ounce bottles up this morning and I just peeled them up. But I reckon they come in right down the door and yeah. the tank up for the night.
Jitterbug with Americans during the war. Uh, okay. Now, where are they from? Manchester, Manchester England. England. He's a singer songwriter. A singer songwriter. I've got one. That is me. Y'all answered in Glasgow, Scotland. I was in the CDs. And I come on down and uh, the train ride uh, in Park Southampton. I don't know what no use that old. <laughs> Let me sit down somewhere. Yeah. Uh, You're just as old as you feel, and he doesn't feel old enough. No, he don't. This man works, old. but If he did, he wouldn't be having his big old garden. Yeah, I tell people, I see another pretty garden on the side of the road. Yeah, I mean, that's it. You know, that's, that's how you describe yourself. Yeah. And along that line. You were down that way originally. Yeah. Yeah, it's just... Alabama. There's a book. Davis Kidd Bookstore. Really? The title of it, Did Your Grandfather Steal My Christmas Tree? And it's got the history and all of him over there in in Germany. And uh, she went over there and met all of his people. And it's really an interesting book. And I I graduated with him. They said when uh, she brought it back here, he went down there that he didn't talk about it. He never talked about the war. He said he just broke down and cried. They said now then he was getting better, he could talk about it. And he was in the same neck of the wood that I was in up there. And in this book, he said, uh, the Germans overrun them up there. Some of Patton's armored outfit come up and rescued them. I bet you a quarter was us. We were way down in southern France and we hightailed it up there. 